This video presents how the functionality of the trim elements to roofs or shell commands has been changed. Besides the new merge elements command, the existing trim to roof or trim to shell commands may also be used to establish a connection between elements for priority based connection purposes. This command is also available from the connect option of the context menu. Please note that this trim to roof or shell command has certain limitations compared to the merge elements command presented in another clip. The trim command works only with roofs or shells and is not available for morph elements. And the purpose of this command is also slightly different than the purpose of the merge command. For example, if the body of a wall needs to go through a roof and we want to create a proper connection, the trim to roof or shell command will not provide the desired results because a part of the wall has also been removed as a result of the trim operation. The functionality of the trim to roof and trim to shell commands has also been changed with the release of ARCHICAD 17. Now there is no need to specify the trimming roof or shell element to complete the trimming operation. It's enough to issue the trim elements to roof or slab command after selecting the elements we wish to trim and then specify which part of the trimmed element we wish to keep. Previously, we could click to an empty area to merge the elements without actually trimming them. Now, either the top or the bottom of the trimmed element will be removed as a result of the trim command. The merge trimming bodies command has also been removed since its functionality has been incorporated with the merge elements command. Please note that solid element operations are always performed on the entire element or composite structure and cannot be applied to skins of elements. This is a conceptual difference between priority-based connections and solid element operations.